Welcome back, family. So I'm here with another rip of Court Kings. This time I'm doing 21, 22 International Blaster Boxes. So again, uh, if you haven't seen already, I did rip the hobby box of this product. And I was able to hit that uh, nice giddy autograph. If you haven't seen that, I'll link a card up here for you to check that out. I really like the design of this product. It has a, as opposed to the photo-based cards this is more of an artistic painting um, for these you get a lot of rookies which is cool uh, and for this in particular with these blasters the biggest thing that you'll be looking for and chasing are the blank slates so that's the chase card here uh, you do have chances for some number cards again the base uh, amethyst to 99 and j to i believe 24 five or 23 uh, 25 I believe for that and then the inserts as well uh, the autos go to eight for for pink so those are some of the things that you'll be looking for I uh, really do like this product that's why I got eight blasters of this um, so let's see and figure out what we can pull now again uh, with these, uh, they're, it's very rookie heavy set because there's four levels of rookie that you can get with uh, increasing rarity. So level one is the kind of the base rookie that you can easily find. Uh, level twos, level threes, which uh, we hit a couple level threes in the hobby box grip, and then the level fours are almost like blank slates. They look very close to a blank slate, but not quite. Um, so. Those are great. You can find one of those, uh, especially if you can get into a parallel, that'd be great. But again, very rookie heavy set, which is why I like it. Um, and then, as opposed to um, the hobby set, where it's one box is only ten, a 10 card pack, these uh, blasters are six cards per pack, six packs per box. So you do get a little bit more chances, maybe get a little bit more of your money as well. They're, they roughly sell for about $100 less than the Hobby Box as well. So again, that was a riskier format for the Hobby, but um, I did. you do get a chance for the higher level rookies as well as I feel like you get more chances at autos. I, th I think you actually guaranteed one auto per box. Um, in addition to the, the difference between the Hobby and the Blasters, and you'll see it on the box itself, uh, there's exclusive acetate rookies that you can find just in these blasters. Um, they look pretty cool, and you get two of those per box on average. So let's see and get ripping. All right. Again, we've already seen the base of these, but this is the base that the cards. And that is a level one Kispert. And Grimes. Again, mostly you're gonna be finding these level one cards, level one rookies and these blasters. And we got a Kispert acetate. Level one, flash, and a giddy. There's the cover boy, acetate. Yeah, yeah, pretty cool. So here. Get well soon. Oh, Teo Maladone. And realize we got an auto with this. I dressed in press rust, but Teo Maladone auto. Impressionist Ink. Think we have another auto? Jared Butler, pull from the back first. T Mac on the Rockets. I think this is an auto. Fresh Paint JPS. J 
Okay. Jason Preston. All right. So we did get another. This is a rookie auto. Uh, and all right, not numbered, but at least it's a rookie, uh, rookie auto. Scotty and our acetate is Jalen. Okay, a little bit better. Tay, another Jalen Suggs. We got two of the same acetate. Which isn't actually uh, uncommon. Again, one of the breaks I did of this, I think I got two fronds. John Johnson and our acetate, Jalen Green. Nice. All right. There we go. Yeah, and the tough thing about these acetates is they do get wear along the edges. Just... Oh, here we go. Finally, we get a parallel on the contemporaries Jokic. There's a Mitchell. But nope, here we go. You see the different foiling, the blue. This one's numbered to. Yep, it looks like we got the bookend, 99 to 99. Thanks. And Garuba. And Suggs again. This is our third one. Jalen Johnson. Alright, so we're getting them, just not the rookies that we want. Alright, so to recap, again, you know, de decent product. The uh, floors, that's a pretty high floor, and the ceiling's definitely there, although it'd be a very rare ceiling with that blank slate. Um, so again, you don't get a whole lot of base compared to everything else in terms of, uh, like as you see with the highlights and the rookies and inserts here, but you get your fair share of decent cards. Again, handful of these base superstars. Um, you get some decent inserts for that. Get, got the artist proof. You do get, again, very rookie heavy set here of getting um, the better rookies, again, and a bunch of them. I think we got two or three of pretty much all the top rookies here. Uh, we got, and most of them though are all, only level one. We only had one level two rookie and the eight blasters that we got there. And again, the biggest thing, Dre draws the acetates for these because they give you at least two per box. So you get your fair share of these um, acetates, which look pretty cool, especially compared to the, the canvas style of the uh, the base cards here. So again, you're just kind of hoping to hit on that there on some of the late rookies like Scotty here, what we got for the insert, press and press, the giddy that we started off with, and then the three Jalen Suggs that we got. Did get one Jalen Green acetate there. Um, and then again, kind of the, the norm, like the expected ceiling here is, um, again, out of the eight boxes, we got one number card and three autos, uh, two of which were rookie autos. Again, hoping that they were better rookies, um, but, you know, not too bad. Uh, it's, it's definitely a fun product, definitely uh, fun to rip. Um, I do recommend it compared, um, again, it's, the ceiling is obviously higher. Uh, for the hobby, uh, but for a hundred dollars less, you know, this is this is probably a good value buy for, for a lot of people. So definitely would recommend it, especially if you're kind of like dipping your toe into the, back into the hobby like I am. So, all right. So that's my thoughts. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Again, if you like this content, please like and subs subscribe. Definitely helps me out. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for stopping by.